Morning guys, Mark Farash with ProTech Dog Trainer. Feed my ravens, probably the last view you'll get of them because I'm gonna be leaving this property in a couple weeks. Be out of here, so it's coming fast. So this will be the, my last little video with the ravens. See how they act with me being over here. I never come over here. I walk away to the shed, so they're gonna be a little bit more offish. Usually they're even more aggressive down here than when I leave the other way and I'm in a different spot. There's Gimpy. He's not trying. He's got himself a potato ship. He says, yeah, I got myself a fry. I don't need those guys. I'm gonna come over here and eat my fry. All right. That's what started all was Gimpy with his gimped up wing and I started wanting to treat him right keep him alive on property because he couldn't fly anywhere so I started feeding him and then everybody else started coming so I just kind of said all right well let's just go ahead and take care of him in that regards right come on babies come on all right let me walk out of here let them eat and then you You hear me talking about genetic stamps. They're hardwired for the fear of man and you can't beat them too much. I was peeking around the corner of the shed, different posture, different view, and right away they flighted. So they're used to my posture when I'm out here doing this. See, they're coming back, they're not worried about it. I got a couple of them that flirt with me all day long on the fence post and they get up on the trees, they talk to me all day and carry on. All right, Mark Fresh Protect Dog Training with Raven Watch, and this will be the last you see of the ravens because I'm moving property. I'll probably get a group of them up there. There's all kinds of birds and stuff in this area, obviously. We're out in the desert, and these are the new buzzards of the desert nowadays. You hardly see the buzzards. They're out here, though, but uh, the, the ravens have kind of taken over. Talk to you later. Have a good day, guys.